We've been reporting on the growing backlash against President Trump's tax plan. Many of you may already be aware you're not getting the refund you expected this tax season. But a growing number of people are also learning they owe the IRS more money, largely because of where they live. NBC News correspondent Tom Costello joins us live this afternoon. Hey, Tom, let's talk about it. What's one of the biggest changes in the new tax plan this year? People need to know. Well, let's talk about your area in particular in Tennessee. Uh, you know, for the most part, you're not going to be experiencing these exorbitant high tax states uh, that we have up on the East Coast. But in Tennessee, the real issue is the refund, right? And, and we all saw that about 80% of the country experienced more money in their paycheck last year. Or did you? Are you saying, wait a minute, I didn't see any more money in the paycheck. Well, guess what? Your federal taxes may have gone down, but your employer may have had to increase how much you are paying for insurance. So it may have, in fact, washed each other out. But now comes uh, tax filing season. You're used to a refund and you're not going to get one because guess what? If you had to pay in less, you're not going to get as much back, if anything. So right. that's a big piece of sticker shock for a lot of people. They expect that money so that they can make home repairs or pay for the kids' braces or whatever, right. and it may not be coming. Yeah, so many people use it to pay down debt. They use it to take a vacation. Yeah. Uh, let's talk about something you just started to mention, though, because sometimes it, it is a wash, right, when you're withholding less, but you're paying more in health insurance. Did you find that people are actually paying more in taxes now with this change? So some people, not as much in your area, but I will tell you a lot of people to your north, up in Connecticut and New Jersey and New York, uh, you know, even Maryland and Virginia, uh, if, if they are in a high tax area, they could be faced with a very high tax bill. And here's why. Uh, right now, you are, you are capped at how much you can write off, how much you can deduct on your taxes from local, state, and property taxes. So if you don't go over $10,000, you're fine. That's the cap. That's the limit. But guess what? In a lot of states, you are seeing property tax bills of fifteen, twenty thousand dollars mm. and we're not talking on mansions. We're talking about I'm really just modest ranch homes where they're spending that kind of money. So now they've got to come up with a balance and write the check. Anything over ten grand they have to write a check for. Ooh. And for a lot of families, that is a real, real sticker shock. Oh yeah, I mean how many people just have that sitting around? Not many. Tom Costello, thanks so much right. for your live reporting. We know that you're gonna have a full report coming up tonight at five thirty on NBC Nightly News, specifically about this issue. It's coming up with Lester Holt in about an hour from now.